Okay, so in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to use a microscope uh, camera or rather a microscope camera adapter. So the equipment that we will need is number one, our microscope, number two, a, a, a T adapter that fits the microscope and you can buy these on eBay or Amazon. And finally, we're going to need a camera that fits the T adapter. Uh, and if you want to look at something uh, like a specimen right away, then you also want to have your slide ready. But we're not going to be doing that uh, today. We're just going to be showing you how to use the camera. So the first step is to take your eyepiece off and put it aside. And then you take your T adapter and make sure that it fits perfectly inside that eyepiece socket. Uh, and this one fits perfectly, so we can just take it out and put it aside. And then you're going to take your camera and your camera will obviously have a lens already attached to it. And we can't use this lens together with the adapter. So we have to take the lens off. Uh, and most cameras will have a lens detach button. Uh, and this one is right over here. So you can press that button, turn the lens, take it off. Uh, and then make sure that you don't put the exposed, size of, uh, exposed side of the lens on the table. So uh, make sure that's, uh, that's all put away. Uh, and then you take your T adapter and you have these red dots. So you have one on the T adapter and one on the camera and you just line those dots up uh, and then you turn until you hear a click and that means it's locked in. Uh, and then you can put this uh, entire assembly into your microscope, into the IP socket. And then you can just use this camera as normal with the exception that uh, the camera will not be able to focus anymore. So you have to focus only with the microscope. Uh, and also when you focus using the camera, it's a different focal setting compared to when you focus with your eyes. Uh, so you have to focus this microscope through the camera, not through your eyes, uh, or else you will not get a clear image. Uh, one common problem that sometimes comes up is uh, if you use a slide that has a cover slip on it, uh, sometimes the camera cannot focus because the focal length uh, differs between your eyes and the camera. And so a clever trick uh, and a simple trick to, to avoid that problem is if you have a dry mount slide, so you're not going to risk damaging uh, or getting your lens dirty, uh, you can just take the cover slip off and use the slide alone. Uh, and that way you can focus better uh, with your microscope camera uh, without risking uh, getting your objective lens dirty. Uh, so that's basically it for this video. Uh, and thank you all for watching.